this question, uh, the answer will have several folders. But yes, this is the, they call it the, um, the Regent Outstanding Teaching Award, the ROTA. I think it's an award that is for the UT system altogether. This is important to me because I think it's, it's nice confirmation of my principles of teaching. That's what, why it's important for me. It's a confirmation somehow that the way I view teaching students, monitoring students, educating students is, I think I learned a lot in the last 17 years, but my principles in teaching and monitoring students, I think I had a good idea on how to do that. And I think I, will, I can tell you that from the very start, I know that two things are very important for teaching. The first one is to inspire students, is, is to inspire students. I tell to my students, I'm not here to prove to you that physics is a difficult topic. And they all go laughing. I think if I succeed into making them liking something, into inspiring them, the, then they will drive me, I will not drive them. It is valid for PhD students, it's valid for my freshman students, it's valid, valid for every single um, level of teaching. So that is one, one aspect of teaching I think it's very important, is to motivate, is to inspire students. The second one is, is to care for students. When you care for a student, you get ideas, you get energy, you, get, you give them time because you know, you know that's what it takes. So these two principles, that's what conducts me to, for teaching, and I think they prove to be very, uh, very important for students. And also, that's for the student, but for me, as, a, as, as something to, to make me happy, is that when I wake up in the morning, and I go in, in my car, and I live, I, li I live where a place where I'm surrounded by doctors in medicine, so I look at them, and I used to think that they go to save lives, okay? So now I know that they go to save lives, and I go also to change lives with my teaching. And uh, always a pleasure to meet students. Um, if I go for an ice cream, I find one of my previous students uh, who is still at UTD, or um, sometime in the street, or... Uh, so it's a pleasure to inspire. Some of my PhD students now are professors themselves, some others from, in fact, I taught several thousand students here at UTD, and from time to time I cross somebody from a business or on LinkedIn they send me and I see how successful they become. So them being suspect, successful is, is, is very important for me. So for all these reasons it's important, but also it's a validation that what I'm doing is important, what I, and I probably learned a lot with time, and I learned how to do it well as well. So, so there are many other reasons, but I will stop here. The main message for students is, for everyone, discover what, what you are passionate about. Discover something. Different people are passionate about different things. But when, when there is passion, we can... I tell to my students, try to strike a balance between three things. First is something that you are passionate about. That's the first thing, something you like to do. Second, something that gives you a living. You have to pay your bills. <laughs> and then the third one is something that you are good at. You know, These three, the combination of these three, um, then we'll give you will give you an idea of a place, a Venn diagram, then you know what, what you should be going after. And I also want to say to, um, don't get discouraged. There will be bumps around the, uh, around the way, there will be difficulties uh, in all of this. Don't get discouraged, don't get, there will be moment of you question the path, but don't, don't doubt yourself. As long as you are realistic about what you can do, and in particular, you are aware of that you are doing something you want to do, I think it should work. As long as you're going, the trajectory is going up, sooner or later you get, you get where you want. So my message to students, do your homework, think about what passionate you, and don't give up, uh, work, work hard on it. Nothing comes for free, but 
One last thing I want to say to students, and I tell always this to my students in the classroom or a PhD, it's not just the objective that matters. Some people want to become a president, some people want to become a doctor, some people want to become a, a journalist, physicist, Nobel Prize, whatever. It's important that to think about two things, values. You need to have ambition, but values also. Integrity, honesty, are very important. And with those values, you do the right work, you will get there. No need for shortcuts, no need for other things. And you will get there. And this I tell always to my students, the journey matters. It's not just finishing a bachelor degree or doing a PhD and you say, oh, I had a diploma. What is important is to, at the end, you, had, you enjoyed doing those three years. Ask me to go redo my PhD anytime, <laughs> anytime I will. It's the journey that matters. So that, those are a, a few advices for students, for all students all over the world and in UTD and uh, overseas everywhere in the world.